the city wants to build this network system or a train system and not sure about how many people agree with it what you could do is to develop the simulator and enter people within that simulator and so they are actually rather than telling them look it is great trust me no let them experience it and since you are running a simulator they can experience a whole week in an hour so they actually connect to the computer in one form or another not, not necessarily for sure reality it could uh, as 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 we know it could be for sure reality in, in in different means to allow a mass communication they can enter that a uh, simulator and live a whole week within one hour and the system register all their gestures all their 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 experiences it, through that and that can be analyzed to feedback what they think but the system is registering like we said soft say soft registering not hard registering of I am now giving verbal feedback that's not what it's registering it's from what I understand it's registering say the joy the happiness the feeling on the, the scaredness it's registering the external emotions soft control maybe if you can call it that but would everyone then be hooked up with sensors how can the computer register that okay it, it, if you look at any virtual reality system the current systems available uh, are a uh, you you wear sensors so you wear a hat to simulate with with a, a glass simulator glasses you wear gloves um, unless you actually develop an intelligent building where the sensors are in the building so, so w what happens is you project the the simulator within that environment and since uh, from a distance how people in, uh, react within that in, in environment uh, it is difficult uh, to, uh, the, the, the more traditional virtual reality uh, systems available the more advanced uh, virtual reality systems that uh, the sensors actually embedded within the intelligent building is still under work so I can't claim that we have the technology but, uh, but yes what, what the system records is your daily life what you do naturally the train is late you are complaining the train is running close to your house you are complaining uh, the train got you on time to the, your uh, job interview you are happy and then while people experiencing what could happen which could actually change your opinion strongly because unlike telling them they are actually living it uh, that's one point. The other point is uh, the building or the, the virtual reality system can, can analyze all these natural reactions to different situations and give feedback, a pro probably more accurate feedback than if you ask people directly.